This tutorial will show you how to customise your clothes using black fabric pen. Place a piece of cardboard in between the two layers of your t-shirt. You can iron a line down the middle of the centre of your t-shirt so you can use that to make a symmetrical design. Sharpie fabric markers are the best. They are sharp, they stay for many washes in the fabric and they are nice and smooth to draw with. Drawing on fabric and painting on fabric is different to paper. It's not smooth. The fabric sticks to the pen as you go. The easiest thing to help is to pull the fabric taut in between your fingers as you draw. This makes drawing a bit easier and smoother. With monochrome drawing, it's easiest if you make designs and patterns that are interesting and that have depth. Things behind each other, things in front of each other. Work it out on a piece of paper if you're not sure how to do this straight onto the fabric. Abstract drawings are great to do because really you can't go wrong. Designs that are most effective are ones that use larger shapes filled with smaller shapes. Black and white checkerboards are effective and eye-catching. Ropes that intertwine with each other so you can almost follow them behind and in front and on top of the drawing. And shapes filling other shapes like circles inside triangles or squares inside circles. None of these shapes have to be perfect. It's hand drawn and that adds interest to it. Here we have some intertwining ropes, twisting and turning underneath and behind. And to make them stand out, you can shade around them in black. That makes them really pop and look 3D. Using the same fabric pen, you can shade around the ropes and any other designs that you've drawn that you want to pop out and look 3D. The black background brings the white objects forward. You could also, for larger areas of black, use black fabric paint and a thin brush. Once your drawing is complete, use a hot iron and a piece of fabric. Iron over your drawing to seal it into your t-shirt. Follow the instructions on the markers. Hope you've enjoyed this short tutorial and maybe you can customise some clothes, perhaps for gifts or just to make your wardrobe unique.